Hey everybody, uh, Linux here, and we're with uh, CAE Linux, um, which is a Linux distro targeted for like the the engineering crowd that makes uh, the models, also uh, draws in CAD and stuff like that. That's what this one is targeted for. I don't know anything about it. I'm just here to show it off because I had it lying around, and. Uh, Otherwise, I will never do it. So, I'm also not sure if these distros are getting a like dedicated page on Spoonfed. I'm not really sure yet. Let's just see what this one brings. Woo! We're in. Alright, this looks like a newer version of Linux. Oh my god. Alright, if you're an engineer, then hopefully you'll know what all these things do. Because I have no idea. Alright, let's just take one. That one. Ah, oh yeah, tutorials. Cool. Maybe we can find out. This is like new to me. Well, here you have mesh and modeling. My god, this is awesome. Wait, there are more than one page. This is what you can do with it. Salome. Well, let's fire that beast up then. Because I saw it in there somewhere. That one. Let's see what, it's, what it does. Ooh. You can do all kinds of. I hope for the people that understand this, they think cool or that's not cool because it's missing something. Because I literally have no clue as to what this all does. Let's just look at the rest. You got standard stuff. All right, you got some powerful. Uh, programming tools. You have the whole QT stuff going on. That's pretty cool. This is PyCAD, what I was talking about. It's the only thing I know of the whole making stuff um, with engineering. Uh, Blender I know, but it's more like a free Maya 3D modeling. So it is 3D modeling, but it can also be used for other stuff. And I must say there are a lot of tools in here I mean a lot you even have elect electronic designers stuff algebra alright for a distro that's targeted towards engineers this one does a one hell of a job because it literally has I think almost everything you need for this and it's running on uh, 10.04 which is pretty decent um, that's it for uh, CAE Linux and I hope if you're an engineer and you're watching this you think I'm gonna switch to that because it has a lot of free tools for me that I can use and you should just experiment with it.